Welcome to this two minute tips video and today we're going to be looking at the high res zoom functionality. Um, this is functionality for video and it's only available in the Z8 and Z9 as it uses the 8K capability of the sensor for an electronic zoom. So there are some criteria that you have to meet in the settings for this to work. You have to be in full frame FX image area. You equally, when you're in your video settings, it only works with ProRes 422 HQ 10-bit with H.265 10-bit or 8-bit and H.264 8-bit. And with these, you have to be in the frame size and rate um, zone in 4K, so 3840 by 2160, you've got to be between 30 frames per second and 24 frames per second. And in 1080p, so 1920 by 1080, you can use it between 120 frames per second and 24 frames per second. Once you've activated it in the video settings and you're within those parameters, then you can zoom in and out using the left and right buttons on the multi selector. And you can zoom in to two times and it shows a bar in the EVF or LCD to show you how far you're zoomed in or zoomed out. Now it is worth noting though that there are some limitations with this um, in that when you're, you've turned it on, then the autofocus area mode is fixed to wide area AF large and there's no focus point and you can't use electronic VR for video, that is switched off. So with these limitations, it's something that is quite useful capability, perhaps when you're using a prime lens. However, I'm not having it switched on all of the time because it does limit the capabilities of the camera, but there are certain situations where those limitations won't matter, and actually having an electronic zoom or a high res zoom could be quite useful. So it's something I'll perhaps turn on in certain situations. I hope you found this useful. Let us know in the comments below, how are you using this? Is it something you're finding in particular situations um, where it's useful? Obviously it's something that only works on the um, cameras, the Z8 and the Z9, where you have an 8K capable sensor. And as always, I look forward to seeing you in a future video.